what's up, people? This is IU Javelin. And this is Neil Black Yoshi. So what we're here to do is talk to you about how to use the Javelin indoors to completely destroy people. You see we've got three classes set up here, one for running to get two spots quickly off the beginning of the spawn. I uh, do that in the beginning of a match just to, to get to places that might not be reachable uh, without marathon, like if I need to go spawn rush people. Uh, support I use for scavenger, obviously, to get infinite ammo for the Javelin. Uh, and then I have Quick Lock, which I use for shots um, that might be under a lot of fire or that might be pressured a lot. I use that because I can lock on quicker and I can get the shot off quicker, so I'm exposed for a less amount of time. Um, here uh, you can see uh, the key to getting a javelin indoors is to aim for a point past the room that you're trying to hit. So in this, in this case, the cave, I aimed outside of the side door to an outer point on the rocks. Um, and the distance was great enough out the door that the javelin thought I was firing outside. So it didn't know that I was actually just trying to hit the cave, so when I fired it, it hit the cave ceiling and killed everyone inside. Uh, same thing can be said for derail. I aimed for the tower outside of the office room where people like to camp, and javelin got tricked into thinking it was outside, hit the ceiling, killed everyone indoors. All right, and All right. here of the state, basically what he does is he aims outside the windows, tricking the javelin, like he said, so that when it goes in, it kills off everybody that's camping inside. He does the same thing at a different angle, this time outside the door, so that if they're leaning more towards the kitchen area, he can pick them off from there. Right now, what he does is he also aims so that if the distance is covered by something, you know, the entrance for the javelin, he'll jump and shoot to get it. And in here, he aims right outside again, gets everybody that's inside, you know, camping or whatnot on the first and second floor. All right, uh, here in Favela, you'll see where it pauses right there. Um, the crosshair is up and to the right on the right windowsill. So what, what I have to do is aim down and to the left so that when the javelin comes out, it doesn't come out centered into the crosshair. It comes out down and to the left, so it sneaks around the white windowsill and doesn't hit it. Um, you'll see that when the javelin fires, right about now, it goes to the left of the windowsill rather than hitting dead on on the crosshair. So it gets inside the room, sneaks in there. Yep, inside High Rise, he does the same thing where he aims outside, you know, he's outside aiming to a far off distance. But what he does here is to, you know, ensure you that the distance has to be enough where you can get an angle that it won't, you know, the javelin won't accidentally fire and kill you off. What he does here is he aims for the far back. After he's got locked on, he waits. Moves to the side, and after he moves, he ducks right underneath. Why? Because a danger close javelin will kill you on accident. He does the same thing here. Aims outside somewhere, moves for cover right away. If you stay lingering in that spot, the javelin will kill you off, and it'll end a kill streak that you, you know, earn with the javelin right there. What he does here, he stops, and he shows you that he's going to angle the javelin to the point where it's going to actually go through the other room and then it's going to angle upwards inside the other room for its trajectory to bounce out. See how it just cuts through and jump, jumps in? That's what he's learned and that's what he's showing you guys off here. Alright, Javelin, thanks for the awkward silence right there, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, the rest of the video is just showing all the different angles you can do on high rise, all the different shots that I've gotten ridiculous amounts of kills with. Uh, we're going to close the video with that. And uh, Thanks for watching this week, guys. Hope you guys get some good multi-kills out of this. Make sure to subscribe. Uh, Nick, get some uh, We're going to have a link to my channel. Make sure you subscribe there also, and have a good one.